to beginning to see the light as you saw on the little thumbnail the teeth and what it's all about is seeing the light about having a gap now there's nothing wrong with playing with air pockets some people do some people don't but some of the air pockets are exacerbated by the teeth are shut so you end up with this tire which is fine if you play like that and it's successful that's great as I said my disclaimer is if your embouchure works that is the best embouchure but if you want to improve from where you are then what we need to do is look at all the aspects and one of the big things is the teeth gap teeth gap and by nipping the finger, you end up this lovely U shape here. Check out the Philip Farkas Art of Brass Playing. He saw the light and has shone the light on lots of brass players, as I'm trying to do with you and my students. So there you go. If you're not sure that your teeth are open, whistle. Or just blow candles out. Physiologically, the mouth, the teeth, won't stay shut when you're expelling air. Whistle. Buzzing is a little bit different. You have to encourage the teeth to stay open with the buzzing. So it's all about... <clears throat> Minding the gap. This is the gap. Much more freedom for the lips to vibrate. Much more freedom for the air to come out without having the resistance too early because there's resistance in the instrument, we know that, and the mouthpiece. However, you need a, a really good stream of air I say to my students, whistle into your hand or blow, blow air and the air should land about here, whether you blow or whistle. But when you buzz, some people do that and the air drops to about here, sometimes the elbow. So, so two whistles and then follow that air through to turn it into a buzz. Then bring your instrument up and see what note it is. Use the mouthpiece like a microphone as opposed to the mouthpiece. Don't change the position of your blowing. So we're going to do it now. I'm going to go. And that was an F. I know it was unfocused and it wasn't a very nice note because I hadn't sorted out where to put the mouthpiece but you heard the note F and that's a B flat and you can see there's no real pressure there at all So let the lips do more work. Make sure they're fed with enough air. So don't forget the teeth gap. Okay, this is Marcus Reynolds, Strutus Brass, the embouchure guy, saying happy blowing and enjoy your blowing by following some of these um, tips. And I hope they've been of help to you. And let me know in the in the down below if it's benefited you and uh, if you want to subscribe that would be great as well okay I'm going now Marcus Reynolds Stratus Brass the embouchure guy <laughs>